I'm here. Oh my god. Listen, Valerie used the beacon to upgrade Gordas and, and summon the vault. Gordas is trying to keep it open, but the monster that came out of it, it it's big. Really, really big. The beacon made Gordas bigger too, but she, she can't handle something like this. Where are you? I, I, I don't know exactly. I, I'm still in the caravan, but I'm not sure... about this thing. The, the monster came with the vault, so maybe if we get rid of the vault, we can... Uh, wait, uh, hold on. There's someone... Sasha? Hey! Hey! Sasha! So... the job. Summoning the vault brought this monster with it. It's bigger than any I've ever seen. 
Whatever needs settling between us isn't gonna matter if we're all dead. We have to destroy Gordis. It's what's keeping the Vault Guardian here. It's too powerful to take out any other way. Go to hell. I'll never help you. We'll all be there together if we don't do something. Just stay out of my way! Just like that, Gordas was gone. Valerie was gone. The vault, the monster that protected it, they were all gone. All we were left with was each other. And the memories of those we lost along the way. All for nothing. patched up there isn't much more to it life sort of returned back to normal well our normal that was it you destroyed Gordas, then walked away moved on with your life like nothing happened i didn't want to shoot her i wish there was some other way what about you After I came to, I grabbed the rights to Atlas on Pandora from Jack's office. Figured I could use it to build something. A fresh start. At that point, it made sense to head back to the Atlas facility we left. Got it going again. Luckily, it was well stocked. Whole lot of fruit. Fixed myself up. Worked on some prototypes. Obviously, that was all after she ditched me on Helios. I can't believe you thought we left you intentionally. If anyone deserves to have trust issues here, it's me. You had a handsome Jack in your head the entire time and, and waited until you were backed into a corner to tell us. It wasn't like that. Besides, I was afraid 
you'd freak out if I said anything. Well, we had every right to freak out. You and Jack... You and Jack ruined our lives. Are you serious? That is what you're pissed about? It was a little more complicated than that. What isn't complicated is the fact that you were making googly eyes at my sister the entire time you were around. Well, I came out with a few scars, too. Come on, punk. Quit stalling. Man, put some hustle in it. I, I ain't got all day. I recognize that voice. Kroger? Hey, really? What is this shit? A debt needs to be repaid. What is that supposed to mean? Tell me this dude be holed up in a bandit camp. The whole damn place was coming after me. You seem fine. I mean, I lost them, but I wouldn't stick around here too long. <laughs> Just a matter of time before they come through. I'll take my chances. Psh, whatever. Oh, look here. We got Fiona and her corporate chump. The name's Reese, thanks. Look at you, all wrapped up like birthday presents. Hey, Kroger, where's your buddy? Oh, wait, I remember now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> remember why you can. <laughs> Look, I brought you your bandit box. We gonna make the trade or what? Two for one. Can't beat that. Take them. No, they ain't making it out of here. This is person. Hey, no, no, stop! This is the end of the line, girl. You, you can't let him do this! So, if you got some last words, just <gasps> to get them out now. Because you know what they say payback is. Come on, at least make it a fair fight. Mm-mm. <clears throat> I like my odds better this way. This one's for Finch! Whoa, whoa, whoa! What's he doing? This? This is weird. I don't know. Maybe he has a question. <laughs> oh, great! A firing squad. I just hit murder bingo!
What do you want? All right. Laser pointers off. Laser pointers? The children of Helios try to avoid guns when it comes to conflict resolution. What? <laughs> I thought I lost you, buddy. <laughs> Same here, man. I can't believe this. Come on. Bring it in, Fiona. You scared the shit out of me. Yeah, I wanted to make a dramatic entrance. It's really good to see you, Vaughn. It's great to see you too, Fiona. We got a lot to catch up on, but it's not entirely safe out here. We'll take you back to the base. Base? Oh, yeah. You're not gonna believe what we've done to the place. I mean, the whole thing was nuts! After Valerie beat the ever-living shit out of me, Cassius was nice enough to take me back to his lab and fix me up. The second time that guy saved my ass. I really owe him. The plan was to figure out a way to get you guys from Valerie. Then you left on the rocket, and Valerie opened the vault, and just all hell broke loose. I tried to find you guys, but eventually I started suspecting the worst. I didn't want to think that way, but, but after a while, it's just hard not to lose hope. Honestly. <laughs> I'm just happy you're safe. Same here, man. The whole thing was so surreal, you know? I mean, Helios crashing. But by the time the dust settled, everyone was gone. Except for the ones that made it to the escape pods. Never expected to be leading a bunch of Hyperion refugees. I mean, they were crawling out of those things like newborns. Just bleary-eyed and scared. Their first day on Pandora. Then you put your newly acquired Pandoran survival skills to work. You joke, but it definitely helped. I mean, look, obviously, I'm no expert, but I was light years ahead of these pencil pushers. I found JR from distribution eating dirt. Liter literally, just sitting there, just shoving dirt into his mouth. Really disturbing. I mean, most of these people, they hadn't spent a waking hour doing anything but just sitting on their ass. Getting sweatier and fatter. <sighs> Which is why we decided to make our base out of what was left of Helios. Cool, right? Whoa. Okay. Yeah, they're pretty deferential. Which is really odd for a bunch of ex-Hyperion. Hello! Um, what is happening right now? They're showing you their respect. Look, me? But this isn't for you? <laughs> You're kidding me. I wish I was. Look, they even have a shrine for them. Um, <laughs> that, that, that's a statue of Jack. Yes, very observant it was, at one point. But, uh, they went ahead and labeled it Reese. Someone tried to alter the face to look like you, but, um... Most of these guys are basically shitty at everything. I am... pretty uncomfortable right now. That makes two of us. Reese, you don't understand. To them, you are the great liberator. You see, you crashing Helios shed them of their corporate shackles. I guess we'll... see how this goes.